okay, okay. Guys, we got breaking fucking news. Oh, hell yeah. We got breaking news. Our boy Drake dropped the disc record today. Come to find out, we didn't think it was, we thought it was AI, yeah. but my, my boy Rick Ralston dropped his disc record about Drake. Yeah. Rick Ralston dropped his disc record about Drake. I bet you Drake wishes it was AI. You know what I'm saying? So, man, look, we we going to sit here and listen to Rick Ross song, and we going to see what we can. We going to rate it. Going to, you know, do our regular rate. You know what I'm saying? So, let's get to it. Let's get to it. So, let's start it off. Here we go. Let you DM my old, but got bitches you can't. Let you get on my songs. It was good for your face. Now, bitch nigga is home. and no room for debate. Pop a perk for the field. Go and count me a meal. Kill you niggas for free. Do it all for the thrill. Niggas leaking their records when we speaking directly. If we keeping the gangster, when you see me, you check me. Man, hey, I'm not going to lie to y'all. He rapping on some iconic ass beats, bro. These beats sound like some old school ass beats, and they just going so hard on it. First, it was fucking Kenji Lamar. Then it was J. Cole. Then it was Drake. Now it's Rick Ross. Like, what's going on? What y'all thought about the song overall? Like, what y'all, th- as a hey, diss I record. Gonna, I ain't going to lie, Cairo. I give that bitch a, like a really an eight. Eight or nine, yeah, bro. Yeah. That he he was eating on that bitch. And for me, I give I give it the same thing. Eight because it's like as a diss record, it was pretty solid. Like yeah, it was, was going off. I didn't expect it, but uh, it was pretty yeah, going I, off. I can't deny that it's it's pretty strong for Ross. Is though now are there some lines that we can make we can make fun of? You know the cop stuff, sure. But uh, yeah, but Ross, I actually think yeah he he uh delivered here. I, and then I, not I, only I that, I think that's fair. The response was fast as hell. This yeah. the fastest yeah. response we ever yeah. got. Yeah, like, well, so but that's what I'm. I want to. I want to ask you, y'all. You caution and uh, Cairo. Do, do you think he just took it personally when he heard it? Because when he heard it, it's clear that he wasn't buying no AI or leak. He heard that and he's like, "Whoa, the thing Drake, is, that's you what don't I was talk like, to me like this." I, was, think, I, I know, put you on. You know, I, I put you on my early hits. You nobody was checking must, for you before must, I put you on. There's been some issues that yeah. we didn't hear, like. For Drake to even diss Rick Ross, there must be some background stuff that we don't know about. Yeah, that's what I feel. But that's what I was saying. Because at first I was going to say, okay, Rick Ross must have already had this in a bag. But no, when he, when he said knows? leaked, when yeah. he said leaked, yeah. I said, oh, nah. yeah, you're right about that. No, he said, it, it, this, like, Damn, you can yo, tell he fuck, heard yeah. it, and he yeah. he you can tell he made this when he was yeah, like. He, he was like, this nigga Potter was eating a burger or yep. some shit. Say, oh, then, hold and, on and, now. And then he <laughs> saw it, and he realized somebody told him, oh, no. Rick, this is legit. This man literally had to pull this Big this Mac is, down. This so. is legit. His team told him this is real. Yeah, this is not AI. This isn't a leak. And he he was uh, basically he was like kind of confirmed yeah, that clearly this upset. Is leak audio and it's not AI. And, and, and just, it's not not and, leak audio. Uh, the but. personal terms Ross puts it in. You know, you were cool at one point. You know, now you turned into what I mean. His words, white boy, right? You turned into a, a white boy. I he, wonder what made you decide that to say this. He kept, you know, saying he's a white boy now. He's white as, as if, you know, Drake being a white boy like, somehow what, what, is the what negative make, part. What make Drake white? That's what I want to know. Like, what make him white? Well, he the example he points to is, oh, well, you call the cops on French Montana or something like that. Or he makes a reference well, to that. Well, I mean, nigga, you was a cop. So I mean, I'm not saying it. No <laughs> you know, I'm, 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 caution, I'm so with you. It's like, wait a minute. He was a cop. You were a correction man. officer. Yeah, we were yeah, a correction man. officer. Like, What's the problem? I, I was hoping he never brought the cop shit up. That's the I, only part I, I, I was kind of down, I kinda you. down, you, I kinda you, down you, about that. You bring it up to the wrong person. You open the door. You open the door. Now we got to go there. We got to talk about Officer Ricky. Remember Officer Ricky? Yeah, y'all remember that CO, CO. I got to do it. Caution, I got to do it. I got to put the photo in this episode. I got to put <laughs> Officer Ricky's Officer photo. Ricky. Oh, I want to tell everybody about Officer well, Ricky. My thing is you bringing it up to a person that's not, who never claimed to be a street dude. Like, yeah, he's a singer, bro. It's like, he's an R&B singer. He's a nice guy. He played on the grassy. Yeah. Like, he take your bitch. Yeah. You know that. You know that Rick Ross. You yeah. know Jake. I mean, I'm and, and guess who else is a performer? Ross. I mean, he was a correctional officer who turned himself into this his persona of a drug dealing kingpin. We know that shit. Well, yeah, right? he took the name. He took from, the name from, from the, somebody. Uh, the, he, he's no more realer house. than Drake. Yeah. Rick, you a cop? They had a cop in the crew. Yeah, yeah, yo, yo, yo. You, like, like, you are officer. Officer Ricky was a you know. What, I mean, you care I, I just hate that he brought up that joke, man. You should have yeah. don't bring up a cop joke. Don't man. bring up police. Don't cop, bring up feds. Yeah, don't don't do that, bro. With the system, man. Why you have to do that, bro? 
Cause I, I guarantee, you, bro, we gonna look at some lot of reactions on YouTube, yo. They gonna bring this shit up. Oh yeah, it's, oh, it's coming up. <laughs> you said something about a cop. Holy shit! You know Drake gonna eat this shit. Oh yeah, up, dude. I mean, it's an easy. If, if, if boy, <laughs> no, I'm serious. If Drake really wants to respond, it's oh so easy. oh yeah, Drake it's, it's so easy. It's like it's, it's like up. wow, you can go. I mean, you know, he not he may not take it that, but it's like it'd be so easy. Cause Ross, like I said, I agree with caution. I don't. I think he he made that's the one. Big mistake Ross made on that. I, I wouldn't have did that, yo. Uh, he kind of left that opening for Drake to come in and just, if he wanted to, just really do what Fifty did. I wonder when Kendrick, what Kendrick come into play in all this. Like, I don't think Kendrick does come into play at least as far as Rick Ross was concerned. There's just no yeah, references. Well, to, with uh, the Rick Ross thing, Kendrick, but I don't know. But but he is the wild card. He is the wild like, card. He's the thing that could at any moment Kendrick can drop something. Yeah, and even if imagine if Drake is winning this battle against Ross, and all of a sudden out of nowhere, can just drop drops a bomb? Yeah, it's so like, it's like that's the that's the tricky part. Yo, okay, 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 man, this show has come to an end. This show has come to an end, and I like to say my farewells to y'all and tell you goodbye. Goodbye. And- like and subscribe. And like, like and subscribe. Follow us on all social media platforms when we ever get them. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>